somebody who's passed on, you know. On aviation, they say it's flown west. Veteran Darcy Vernier served in the Vietnam War in Marine Corps. He says serving his country is something he holds close to his heart. Most of my job was trying to get guys out of horrible situations. I mostly medevacs and recons. When he wasn't flying helicopters, Vernier says one of his favorite pastimes was playing the trumpet. On this Memorial Day, Vernier joined with tens of thousands of musicians for taps across America. CBS News's Steve Hartman came up with the idea during the thick of the pandemic when the traditional parades were canceled. The call is played at 3 p.m. local time for one minute. People are asked to pause and remember those who died in military service to the United States. This new tradition to honor the fallen is bringing together musicians of all ages, like Kenji Fujimoto, who says his grandfather inspired him to take part. He was a World War II veteran in the 442nd Regiment, and I think that it's a beautiful way to celebrate you know, my grandfather as a veteran. Taps Across America invites anyone to play, musically inclined or not. College musician Nora Kranz says she hopes that inspires more people to embrace the art. I think it's really important and it's a good reason to uh, pick up an instrument. When played at Memorial Day, TAPS helps acknowledge the true meaning of the holiday. It's a reminder. You know, is there an end to this? Didn't seem to be. TAPS is played at 3 p.m. local time because that's when organizers say most people are home and enjoying the holiday. Reporting in La Crescenta, Lauren Posen, CBS2 News.